Hey guys, check out this next band. They have a hot name called Swamp De Womp. My name's Katie, and you're watching Guitar Shop TV. Leaning on my red, a four-wheel four. Can't get enough of your goodbye. Can't stop kissing, can't stop touching. And I got this feeling. Now from deep inside Said, You pull on my back pocket Well, man, to tell you the truth, that song, uh, Swamp to Womp, was uh, born in a song. We were writing the first record. Uh, there's a track on there called Birthday. And to this day, you can still hear it in the ending of the track. Uh, so when I write, when we write music, I'll do a lot of scatting and stuff. You know, looking for phrasing that works in the song and whatnot, and melodies and so forth. So I'm not really saying any words. I'm just, but this is happening to keep but I'm You know what I mean? And I'll find something that works, and then I'll put I actually try to make it make sense with words, right? But uh, and in that we record every session we do, and uh, when we played that song back, uh, it's just plain as day. You can hear me going, swamp the bomb, swamp the bomb, yeah. <laughs> So that's where it was born. And then, you know, when we were kicking around band names, one of the guys said, hey, why don't we just call it Swamp the Wall? Like, well, surely no one else has got that one, so. Some of the sweat rolling down our skin. And I'm all wrapped up because you won't quit messing with me. Ten minutes till midnight, and you're glowing in the moonlight. I know I need to get on home, but I can't leave. You keep on. 2004, I've been doing, you know, working on a studio and doing some writing, and uh, that's about the time I hooked up with David Lee, the drummer, and uh, we just started working on the project, man. And uh, David is born and bred in this area, so he knew, you know, pretty much all the good players, you know, that were worth calling up, and. Uh, that's what we did, man, and here we are. It's our six-year anniversary this month. There ain't no way to move. Wanna drown like a demon out off and go screaming. Shut up on the devil's blue. Find some sexy downtown hit shop and get your name a tattoo. And, you know, um, diverse bunch of guys, but I think everybody in the band pretty much um, would tell you uh, Leonard Skinner, uh, Led Zeppelin, um, you know, for me, one of my big influences, man, as a writer, was Phil Collins, you know. Uh, he kind of instilled in me the desire to pass along messages in my songs to touch other people to help them through, you know, crises and whatnot. And, um, other than that, you know, Almond Brothers, um, God, on and on, man, Credence, you know, I think we take a little bit from everybody, honestly. Money, 